You ready for it? Look at this guy. Every day at this hour, he's so dramatic. Look at him. He's out. Look, even his eyes are somewhat open. Oh. <laughs> Nothing. Oh, I don't see his path there. Nope, just a lone squirrel and Alfred. Anything? Oh, are we getting some movement? I bet if I do this. Hey, what you doing? Oh, sorry for bothering you. Oh, I just went looking around for everybody and I think everybody's outside. Hi. Hi, Betty, I love you. Sweet girl. Oh, hi. <laughs> hi, baby. How are you, sweet boy? You doing good? You being cute? Yeah, you too, Betty. Hi, Bubba. And how are we doing? How are we doing with our new year older age this week? Ah! Oh, Betty. <laughs> you are too much. So how's it going? Yeah? You just gonna start purring? Oh, Betty. Be <laughs> oh my god. Everybody's just being all kinds of cute. Betty. Betty started this new thing. Does anybody else's cat do this? But she started this new thing. When she hears, well, sometimes I don't have an alarm, but when she knows I'm about to get up. Hi, babe, I'm talking about ya. When she knows I'm about to get up in the morning, she'll walk all around and then get on top of me and knead and lay on me and be all cute. And it makes me have a late start to the morning usually. Look at her. She's my girl. Oh, and then she whips her tail in puppy's face. He's tolerant. He doesn't mind. Such a little lady. Boop. Have you had enough? I love you so much. Oh, Betty. <laughs> Sweet thing. <laughs> Look at her. I swear they're all so entertaining in their own way. Hi. Oh. Hi, Alfred. Look at you. Look at how big he's getting, though. I feel like I say the same things in all of these videos. I know they're kind of repetitive updates lately. You know, everybody's doing well. And I'm super duper duper busy. And I need to get my filming set up. I know, buddy. The proper environment or area in the room to where I can start doing those tapping videos again. You don't like when my hand is moving on top of you, do you? Stress management, you guys really seem to value those and hi puppy. But yes, I want to get back in order with all of those videos where you actually see my face because right now I feel like you see my hands and um, a lot of cats. But it looks like it's about to rain and I actually have to get to the store because they just ran out of food when I put their dinner down. So I'm gonna go get more meat and things to make their raw cat food and keep on working. And these two are actually due for their physicals, for their vet visits. So I'm gonna have to schedule those and get definitely his blood work just to ensure that everything's still going good because it's always good to get. You guys are so cute, you're distracting me. Even if there's no issues, which you never want issues, but just once they get over a certain age, you always wanna get their blood work once a year, but then get their vet visits in just for their overall checkups twice a year, so every six months. I would say I do prioritize because it's so expensive and I don't have pet insurance and I feel like a single mama having to, you know, front all of the expenses for these babies, but puppy's priority. Alfred is second, and these two kind of come in third. I mean, they're so healthy, they're so good, they're so young. I'm all about preventative care when it comes to my babies, my fur babies. When it comes to humans and myself as well, that is what I try to educate clients about, and that's what I live myself. Oh, I hear a squirrel through the trees. <gasps> what is that? <gasps> what is that? Oh no. Are those wasps? Oh no. That's not bees, right? That's, yeah, I... okay. So there's one more thing added to the list. I have to figure out uh, how to handle that. Benny, I wish that we could speak the same language. Sweet. Oh, here he comes again. See, I always say Benny's the one that wants attention, but look at him. He always comes and puts his little butt to me. And then they fight for it. You're so vocal. Oh, Betty, so dramatic. Listener. Oh, you guys. Okay. <laughs> You're so dramatic. Yeah, you are. 
Come on, you gonna go at it again? <laughs> She's such a sassy girl. Okay, I am procrastinating. Yeah, definitely need to take care of that. Say thanks for watching. Thanks for liking these quick little updates. As Groundhog Day as they may come across. You smell pepper? I saw pepper earlier today. You smell peppy pots? You crazy girl. Say bye, Betty. Oh, I love them so much. Say bye, Rooney Baloney. Crazy girl.